Hey everyone, Jay Grams here again. We're going to do a showroom tour. We're in uh, what we call showroom number five. We have buildings and buildings full of cars. Now, if you go to volocars.com, you can see every car with 100 pictures top to bottom, full description, videos. Uh, so if I glance past one that you like, you want to know more about, visit our website. Uh, I've also noticed sometimes a car gets reduced and they don't update the sign. So the lowest prices you'll find are on the website also. This is four grand less online. Now something like this you can own for just over 400 bucks a month. We have terms up to 15 years so you can't afford these cars. The reason this one's here, black with red interior. Is that not killer? It's also the manual shift, it's low miles. Uh, I can't recall seeing a black with red interior Corvette Roadster like that. But everything we buy, we try and buy top quality and we try and buy the special ones, low miles. Like here's a red prowler with the chrome wheels, 2,300 actual miles. This has the old school hot rod look, but all the modern technology for you. Uh, here's a personal favorite of mine. Yeah, just the Cutlass, but it's a 70 Cutlass convertible. I've had such good luck with these cars. They're just comfortable. Uh, they cruise, they're reliable, and this one's no exception. This car, instantly, you just get in it and you drive 200 feet and you'll know what I mean. It's just smooth as can be. Uh, 310 horsepower rocket motor, air conditioned, show quality car throughout, but you're gonna wanna drive that one. 65 Corvette Coupe. The coupes, the C2 Corvette coupes are just amazing. The looks, this is, they nailed it. <laughs> uh, and that's a number match, concourse, nut and bolt restored, fuely car, 375 horsepower with a four speed, 411 gears. And you're shifting through them gears, you're gonna hear them pipes roaring. That's an amazing car. This is an amazing car, 71 Camaro SS, uh, resto mod, super meticulous. Usually they got the blower sticking out of the hood. It was a mechanic. Mechanics aren't the cleanest people, and, uh, but that's not the case with this car. This is a hot rod that you can drive. I was just on YouTube sitting on my couch and I actually ran across a video of this car. The owner that built it was being interviewed. It was about a 20 minute video of him telling us all about it front to back. Uh, 800 horsepower, but yet it's a cruiser. We put a link on our website. So if you go on this car, there's a link. You can watch the video. Uh, be careful though, after you watch the video, you're gonna hit the buy it now button. Very impressive car right there. Uh, here's a low mile blue Z06 manual transmission. I mentioned the buy it now. Each car has a button on our website. You hit that if you see something you like. That just gets it locked in for you. You can still talk to the salesman and get all your ducks in a row. Uh, here's another special car, 2013 Subaru, but it's the special edition, one of 100 made. That's it, 100 made. Manual trans, sport seats, the big spoiler, performance, everything, brakes, motor. Uh, it's got all the good stuff. I absolutely love this GTX. If you ask me what my favorite, it's like picking your favorite kid. Um, stunning restoration. Look at the red with the red lines and the chrome wheels. But come, come check this out. This is really what makes this car special. Factory born red with the silver interior. What a combination. You won't see another one. The dash is restored beautifully. It's a four speed shifter. That car is cool. 2014 Shelby GT500 with low miles, 723 horsepower at the rear wheels. That's just killer crazy fast. Very meticulously built Camaro, uh, also crazy fast. It's got 536 horsepower on a dyno out of a 383 stroker motor, glove soft leather upholstery, not vinyl. So many people tell me, yeah, I got leather upholstery. And it's not. That's actual leather. Ceramic coated paint. Fly couldn't land on it. Got a red Viper. 70 Mach 1. 
I've always been a GM guy, but you got to admit the 6970 Mach 1 fastback body lines are just killer. And you get the louvers and spoilers and the magnum wheels and a great color like this one has. Just an absolutely killer car. This is very sharp, nice, rich, dark metallic green with a pearl white interior. Body off frame restored, 400 motor with a four speed shifter. So we try and buy the special ones. And speaking of special, we, we refer to this as the carbon Camaro because it has actual carbon fiber parts. Spoiler, the bumpers are carbon fiber, sill plates, even the inner fenders, parts under the hood. Uh, actual carbon fiber, and that's cool, but I mean, this is a full-blown uh, Pro Touring custom brakes, suspension, uh, LS supercharged motor. Uh, it's just an amazing car to drive. I was negotiating trying to buy this car, and I thought I was, I was at the end of my rope with my offer, and then he started it, and I immediately raised my offer a few thousand more, and, we made a deal. That's a, that's a killer build. And here on the opposite end of the spectrum, this is a survivor. This car is 15,900 actual miles. I know they put some Kreger wheels on there, which I love, but it, this is an all original car. I mean, original, never been painted, never been upholstered. This thing is crazy nice. And this is from the Wellborn uh, collection. He's known for dealing, or not dealing, but collecting in high-end Mopars. Uh, he has some of the rarest Mopars in his collection. There's actually a magazine article uh, with his collection, and this car is part of that article. It's the real deal. Got a few more Mopars for you. Uh, this is from the movie Total Recall with Arnold Schwarzenegger. This is a car from the future. And it, in the movie, I think they called it a, a Chrysler, like a 20... 75 Chrysler or something like that. Obviously, it's a movie prop, but that is the actual uh, from the movie. Uh, but here's another Mopar, 64 Dodge Polara Gasser. The Gasser is the nickname they gave this type of car. It sits up real high. They put a solid axle under the front, lifts the whole car up. That's to give weight to the back tires so it gets better traction. Under the hood is a 528 Hemi with 660 horsepower. But you know what? It's an elderly, retired gentleman that owns it. He drove the car here. You don't have to put this on a trailer. He drove this thing about an hour and a half to get to Volo the day we acquired it. Got some big old fat tires underneath it. Speaking of big old fat tires, pan over to this Camaro here. This is a factory built race car. Uh, this is one of 69 built. It's a Camaro Copo, supercharged, full roll cage. Look at no mirrors. I mean, literally, this is a factory built race car. And guess what? It's never been raced. It was bought as a collector item uh, and the car is still like brand new. Doesn't even have a uh, mile, two miles on it. Yeah, nice looking Camaro with uh, just a nice overall build, sharp looking, it's got some nice upgrades, nice stance. Remember, volocars.com, that's where you can see all of these uh, cars. One of the best DeLoreans in the country. It's got about 4,000 miles on it. I have seen them, I've owned them with even less miles. But this, I'm telling you, is the best one I've ever seen. It is service, detailed, dialed in, like new. All the little quirky things have been uh, taken care of. Another stunning Corvette in blue, Z06, manual shift. Speaking of stunning colors, <laughs> my heart goes pitter-patter. This thing here, the red with the saddle tan interior. Uh, Maserati, the body lines, the wheels, the big brakes, Ferrari motor. This thing is just killer. And the sound on our YouTube channel, look for this uh, video of this car. We film it running. I drove this car home one night and uh, I, I don't know why I don't keep it. I, I really should. I just get so busy and wrapped up in things. I tell myself I should keep it. And uh, 
and I, I don't, then I regret it. Awesome car for the money. This is another extremely rare car, 2002 ZL1 Phase 3 Supercar. They made 69 of these. This is a 427 with 600 horsepower. And this one here has like no miles on it. It has 400 miles on this car. Blue with white leather interior. That's a crazy collector car right here. Oh, why is Jay have a, a black Pontiac four-door sedan sitting in the showroom? Well, it's the G8 GXP, the performance model, loaded up. 1,500 actual miles, and it's a, a six-speed, or five, five or six? Yeah, I think that's a six-speed manual transmission in there. This is a high-performance, rare, limited-edition car. Good-looking car. God, another rare Camaro. This is the last Camaro built, and then they did start making them again years later, but this is the last O2 Camaro off the assembly line. It's a Z28. It's got, like, no miles on it. 27 actual miles, not 27,000, 27 actual miles. That's a car I will definitely be looking back someday saying we should have kept that one. I think that's greatly undervalued right now. That's, that's way better than money in the bank. Uh, 10,000 mile Cobra SVT Mustang, manual shift, nice bright yellow chrome wheels. And I have a soft spot for all the cars of the 50s. That's when cars had style. Look at the chrome. Look at these big bullets on the front. There's more metal right there than, than there is in a modern Kia. <laughs> this is a 55 Buick Century considered a muscle car. That's the, they call it the smaller body, believe it or not. But it has the big uh, Riviera engine. Uh, so this is a, a muscle car. This one's been body off the frame restored. Underneath is as beautiful as it is on top, sitting on the Buick wire wheels. And that upholstery is glove soft leather. Come on, you know you pull in anywhere with that car. You're gonna make a statement. You don't even have to pull in anywhere. You just open your garage door and stand and look at it. And I guarantee you'll get a little pitter patter. Just a fun toy, 11,000 mile 01 Camaro SS. I couldn't resist buying it. It's got everything, red, polished wheels, stick shift, loaded, power seat, leather upholstery, LS motor with 325 horsepower. It has a Ram Air induction. This belongs in an art museum. I mean, look, look at the sweeping lines. Look at that. This is just absolutely Gorgeous, the color, oh, it's like a piece of candy. But I don't think it belongs in an art museum. I think it belongs uh, in the collector's hands that gets out and uses it and enjoys the car. That's what these are really for. It's rolling art, art on wheels. You thought the other Prowler was low miles with 2,300? This has 300, 324 actual miles on this 99 red Prowler. Like brand new. And we had a couple of Grand Nationals, both of them about 9,000 miles a piece. I mean, that's the muscle car of the decade there, of the 80s. I mean, that, that, was the, uh, that was the bomb, still is. Britney Spears Mercedes. A lot of celebrities own a lot of cars, but this car is almost as famous as her. This car has been all over the news and TMZ. Uh, she has been in little fender benders. She's been uh, gotten tickets in this car. There are so many pictures of her with this car uh, and doing things like uh, like being pulled over and that sort of thing. But this this car and her have a real uh, you know, had a real life together. <laughs> 05 GTO, low miles, six speed, LS motor. These are quick. They don't look like it, but that's a spunky little sports car. 
45 actual miles, a Beretta Indy, uh, fully loaded, sunroof, manual transmission in this one too. That's a rare collector piece. We got a 2012 Shelby GT500. I love the black with the red striping. It even matches the interior. There's red striping across the seats. Those things sound great. They're quick. Probably the world's nicest Volkswagen thing. Also great colors, the modern gray that's real popular and bam, red interior really just pops. And this has got a little more than the original 38 horsepower. Uh, it's got a performance built motor. Another Maserati like the red one I'd shown you earlier. Really, check these cars out. I've driven Rolls Royces and Ferraris and all that good stuff. For the money, these are absolutely gorgeous cars. People are going to think you're driving a $300,000 car. They got the looks, the style, the sound. Uh, just amazing uh, car. Here's a Firebird convertible, and look what's under the hood, an LS motor. This is a full-blown Pro Touring serpentine belt, air-conditioned LS motor. Uh, you know, custom brakes, suspension. It's a six, no, five-speed manual trans. And then George, who uh, manages the showrooms, he moves the cars around. He affectionately calls this 1950 Ford Sweet Pea. He says this is just one of the best cars in the showroom. It always starts right up and runs beautifully. He's never using a jumper pack. He's never wiping up puddles of oil. He's never putting hair in the tire. He said this thing is just a sweetheart of a car, sweet pea. Uh, and online, I think it's at 36.9. I, I, that's a joke for this car. That is so cheap for such a beautiful Ford convertible, genuine leather interior. Uh, we got it from a local collector. It's owned it a long time. But yeah, 36.9, looking for a payment. So yeah, your payment's gonna be close to 400 bucks a month. Then you could own something like that. And here's the last one to wrap it up. 63 Chevy Impala, full body off frame restoration, stunning red, dual quad motor, 3D3 stroker, stick shift, air condition all sorts of goodies. Check out this original interior. Well, it's not original. It sure looks like it. it has the piping, the buttons, all the stitching is exactly the same as the original. This is glove soft leather. All of the seats are leather. Even the door panels are done as the original, but in glove soft leather. You talk about no expense spared. So that wraps up this showroom. We'll hit uh, the shop next week and you'll see some new arrivals that literally uh, just arrived. So thanks for watching.